everyone my dog would really <laughs> like to say hi i don't know if that's actually true she was just asleep on my lap but she woke up as soon as i pressed film so hey what's up she wants to say hi to y'all um, but yeah. Anyways, today we're going to be doing the 100 baby challenge. As always, we are tortured by it. That honestly might be my new little slogan. Um, because I've said it twice now and I kind of like it. Um, but anyway, yeah, let's get into the 100 baby challenge. Okay, so this is just a recap more for myself than anything, honestly, because I have not played this save or really The Sims in a while because... This is the first time I'll be recording since I finished exams. So if you didn't know, I finished exams um, recently. Some university exams. It was my first ever university exams. Very stressful, but yeah. So she has a toddler. Oh, Marcus is calling. Sure. Um, anyway, so I think that, yeah, anyway. <laughs> Recap, we have a toddler, his name is Grover, and then we have uh, an infant, and then we have an infant, and his name is Franklin. Oh, is she getting called again? He's calling again. I don't care, honestly. Go away, Marcus. Um, if you've watched all the episodes, you know the beef with Marcus. Um, so anyway, the plan for this episode is to get pregnant again and possibly age up Franklin, honestly. I don't remember where he's at, so how far away is Four days. I think... Yeah, I think I film for like usually an hour and then I cut it down into like 10 to 20 minutes. So I think that should be doable in an hour. But I also want to say if you like saw um, Grover last time, you're like, he looks different. I changed his Kaz like off camera. Um, I think that's going to be the plan from now on. Just like doing their Kaz in between episodes because it's a bit fun and like to make them look a bit nicer than the random things, but to not take up too much time. But yeah, anyway, so plan is... First, get pregnant. Guys, we have the passed away thing. Okay, obviously we can't get married. So I have to choose the under what conditions. This has happened twice now in this series, which I'm like, how does it keep happening? You know, I feel like maybe they should <laughs> lessen the chances, but that's fine. I'm okay with some extra cash. So under what conditions? Thank you for the money. Oh, <laughs> you already have something up. Oh, oh yeah, his milestones. Yeah, very clever conditions. I know, I know. Um, I invited Dominic over. And he never replied, so I assume he's coming, but I haven't seen him. Oh, here we go. Right on time. <laughs> okay, so yes, we invited Dominic over, but then this guy appeared across the street and I was like, who is this man? He does look a bit werewolfish, but that's all oh, he's leaving. Okay, well, I was just going to say, we started a relationship with another person, which is great because, oh my god, this challenge is already proving to be hard with the amount of male counterparts that we can find. Oh no, and I kind of forgot about um Grover. See Daisy, um, is he okay? Does he need food? Ah, he's fine, he's fine. He'll just go to bed himself like when he's finished. I kind of was just like, oh yeah, get his movement still up, it's fine. If he just like finishes that and goes to bed, it'll be fine. I think also maybe, what are her needs? So her needs are like running a bit low, but Dominic is still here. Okay, maybe I might like fix her needs and try and like start something with Dominic, you know? Okay, they've got such good chemistry. This is, this is good. This is good. <laughs> okay, hopefully he stays around until she has a shower because then we can just, you know, we can just start, start things slow, um, but hopefully get a bit faster because we need a third child ASAP. We need to like get this along because we are already what, like, I think by this time we'll be like four episodes in. Nah, we need more than two children. <laughs> okay, so like I'm thinking maybe we hire a maid because the house is getting so dirty and I just don't really know how to deal with it because she doesn't have enough time to like pull out a vacuum every day. So I think if we just hire a maid this one time, get it all set up and then we just like quickly make sure it's clean every day, it'll be fine. I tell myself that about my own house every single day and it doesn't, it doesn't happen. But I'm hoping in The Sims I have better luck. Oh my god, okay, she's still asleep, but Grover is just so cute. Like, look how tiny he is. I love Grover so much. He's so cute. And the clothes I chose were the best clothes ever for him. Oh, he's throwing a tantrum. Okay, a little less cute now, but the clothes I chose, oh, I'm so happy with them. Like, I love just looking through all the clothes. It's so fun. Like, it's the best, honestly. Best thing ever. My question is, why is she still asleep? This is taking forever. Honestly, I might just have to leave her with half energy, but half energy is really going to drain out it. Maybe, maybe I'll let her sleep. <laughs> oh no, okay. She needs to wake up because I just got the, like, Grover relies on other people to take care of him. So, um, I need to get her. Why is she embarrassed? Okay, wait, let me look at his needs first. He needs to go to the bathroom. He's hungry and he needs to sleep. Why is she embarrassed? Oh, great. The maid's going to be here soon. I don't remember when she passed out on the sidewalk, um, but that's fine. I think we'll feed Grover though. I think that's the best thing. Yeah, I'm going to have to wake him up first. Marcus, will Marcus Flex ever stop calling me? Great. I'm so glad Marcus 
stop calling me. Simply stop. I don't need to hear from you anymore. I've had your child and that's all I need. Is it against the rules to hire a nanny? Let me Google that real quick. Cause I actually, maids can be hired, but they can't help with toddlers. That's all I needed. So like, it's fine, it's fine. Um, But we did just get the mail been delivered, which obviously means bills. So I think that's something that we're gonna have to pay, which is just great. Oh, she's, <laughs> she swapped which car he was in. Great. I love how she's constantly in her pajamas because honestly, that is, it's a mood. Honestly, like if you know me in real life, it's, yeah. Why is the maid just kind of hanging out? Do I introduce myself to her? Like, why is she not coming inside? It's been hours since we hired her <laughs> and she just hasn't, my house is still a mess. It's still, it's still, still not going well. Is she gonna come inside? Do I have to hire, hire a new maid? Um, is there a question? Can you, can you clean my house, please? I'm guessing the answer is no. Um, not romance. Okay, you know what? I don't care. I simply don't care. We need to find some guys to hang out with. Okay, who is this? Yep, sure. Knox, what's up? Invite in. Oh, what have I just done? I do not play The Sims enough to understand what's going on. I play The Sims every single day. I'm in the gameplay of The Sims. I don't play enough. I don't know what I just agreed to in inviting him in, but I'm sure it'll be great. I'm just hoping he can have a child with me. That's all I really want in this honestly where is she going what is she doing invite him in um okay well we invited him in but they're still outside and now she's just introducing herself so you know what whatever for oh she needs to go to the bathroom um we might have to do that that might be a good idea but i'm really funny if something bad happened in this game <laughs> just it's now night and we've made no progress i think we need a hire a mate again though i don't know what that was about but she just didn't come inside so not helpful i think but yeah i think we're gonna have to hire a maid again <laughs> deal with that cancel maid so maybe she was coming tomorrow but she was out the front of our house and we talked to her so i'm a bit confused just a bit oh grover's crying great 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 this is just great did she just charge me money for that she just charged me 150 dollars and she didn't even clean my house. Look how dirty my house is. I'm not paying you to stand in my front yard and talk to me. That's just friendship, but <laughs> like still, just come on. So fun fact, when I was recording this the other night, our power went out because they're doing construction on a train line that is right near my house. So I um, it's a different day now and I'm filming, but I'm just gonna continue the episode because 15 minutes, there would not be enough content there to make up an episode. Um, but I just thought y'all would be wondering why I look a little different. So that's why. Um, I don't even remember what was happening. I think, okay, how long have the kids got to age up, right? Maybe I already did this. Oh, um, he needs food. Did we make food? Yeah, right, okay. He needs like food bad. Oh, okay. Let me just grab two and then I'll send him to bed. Um, but I want to see how long they've got to age up. How do I see that again? Is it here? Yeah. So he's got six days. Oh, yeah, I remember that. <laughs> Whoopsie daisy. Oh, what are all these? First nightmare. Oh, celebrate. Okay, sorry. I'm just like obsessed with these. Anyway, so he's got six days. Yeah, six days. And then Franklin has got what? Three. Okay. So Franklin's gonna, we really need to get pregnant because we like need to have an infant and a newborn going at all times. And currently we don't have that. So is he just like dreaming? Well, that's kind of cute for sleep. I don't know. She obviously needs to take care of them, but she needs to like invite someone over. So this is Ian's child, right? Grover's Ian and Franklin is Marcus, right? So we need to have a child with like several different more people. I'm just trying to work out who we're going to invite over, right? So let's see, who can we get to come over? Okay, it's always worked out for me to just like invite over a few people. So I think if we invite over four, it'll kind of work out better. It is going to be night when she wakes up, so they're all going to be asleep though. Unless she invites them over right now, but then they're going to go home. Maybe I'll just let her, <laughs> let her sleep through the night. Okay, I think Grover needs to like chill. Did he not eat or did he? This child. Yes, I get he's helpless. Okay, do not take him away. I, I can't do this again. I can't, I can't do this again. Grover, you need to go eat food. Like, why is he not doing what I'm telling him? Or is he? And he's just like, okay, the game is going so I don't know if my game is just glitching. I've actually had this happen for the past two nights. My game's been like really glitchy. I don't know if this is happening for anyone. What is he cooking? I don't know if this is happening for anyone else, but who is this? Yeah, it's just, it's not working well for me, this game. Um, And that's why I also haven't been filming that much because the games just haven't been working. I don't know why. <laughs> um, ah, okay, great. Would be great for a different game where we don't really have to worry. 
<laughs> about taking care of several children and having several more children. Um, but I think we just need to build up our relationship. No, did everyone go home? Oh, that's so sad. <laughs> I was gonna say, we just need to build up all our relationships. I guess it's late. Where is she going? Oh, okay. Yeah, keep talking. No, no, don't leave, man. Oh, did that go well? Oh, okay. Oh, no, no, it didn't. Oh, why is this not going well for me? It's like actually really sad. I'm thinking we're gonna have to go to a new bar and find a bunch of new guys because it's just not working out for me lately. I don't know why. It's really upsetting to me, honestly. <laughs> I also, okay, I remember we hired a, um, a cleaner and then it just, she just stood outside our house and didn't clean her house. Now our house is still dirty. So I think we might have to hire a cleaner again. <laughs> um, okay. If best doesn't leave us alone, do I like give her money? Or maybe I'll call her up for never paying me back. What'd she say? Oh, I hate all these stupid things. Oh, she gave me more money. Great. Maybe she'll call her out more often. <laughs> <laughs> with all the money. I literally think I gave her like probably $10,000, but we're just trying to build up a relationship because honestly, I think him and um Delilah, they, they like each other. Honestly, every time she makes advances on him, he doesn't like it, but I think he could. I think he could learn to love her. Now also, I hired a nanny again, right? Where is she? <laughs> because every single time I hire a nanny, it just doesn't, she doesn't show up and it's really annoying. <laughs> okay guys, I forgot you could do this. I forgot like clubs were a thing. So I can just add everyone that I, all the guys I want into a club and make all the club activities like be romantic, woohoo, hug, clean and cook. This makes it so much easier. What should we call it? We should call, call this cheating, no. I was gonna call it cheating the 100 baby challenge club, but that's like, we're not cheating. It's an aspect of the game. And I don't think any rules say I can't do this. If it, maybe I'll check after, but I'm gonna take advantage until I know. Because I, what do I call it? I'll call it the 100 baby squad. Cause I can literally just add in whoever I want. It's not, it's invite only, sorry. Um, and just, oh, can I make, can I make it my house? It's gonna help me so much. Let's look at the band activities though. Is there anything like interesting we can have? I don't think so. I think the only one I could put was like be mean and like fight. So none of them can fight. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like put all the things we don't want and then put all the negative interactions because then they can't, they can't lose um like, what's it called? You know what I mean? They can't lose like social levels. Let's do it. I think this is gonna be great. Oh, I gotta choose a, oh, what Ebelin do we choose? Surely that one. Or unless it's a baby one. Is there a baby one? That's so disappointing. I could have chosen a baby one, but that's all right. Okay, that's fine. This is so smart. Okay, I'm gonna start a gathering when she wakes up because then they all just come over. <laughs> Y'all, this is, this is the smartest thing I've ever done and everyone else already knew about this, but I didn't. So, oh, okay, I gotta feed Grover. That's, that's one thing. Okay, Grover, yep. That's the thing, he can read. it's not like I'm barring him from food. Oh, they're all gonna try, I didn't think about the fact that they're all gonna try and start cooking at the same time. This was unanticipated, but I think it's fine. Oh, okay, the milestones are so cute. And like, oh, there's Ian, he's, he's Grover's father. The milestones are so cute. I wish I wasn't playing the 100 baby challenge. Just maids keep charging me for cleaning my house. And now I've got the 100 baby squad to clean my house, so I don't need them. But it's so annoying because they don't show up. Okay, she's awake now. Her needs are fine. What if I just... See, look, I can do all these things. Um, okay, I think like, do they have to have, can they do that? Is he gonna reject it? Oh, why should she got a little crown? That's cute. That is, this is the smartest thing I've ever done. This surely has to be cheating, right? Oh, okay, Grover's, wait, do we need to like take care of Grover? <laughs> I'm gonna look up if this is like illegal in the 100 baby challenge, because I think I'm cheating. It literally says your matriarch may join and create clubs as long as the club activities do not violate any challenge rules. I don't think they do, right? They don't. I'm gonna like have to properly research it after this episode, but I'm not gonna do it until the end of that. I'm taking advantage and I think I deserve it because honestly we had Hazel taken away from us. Oh, he can't, he can't use the toilet. I was gonna say she needs to take a pregnancy test because it might not have worked anyway. The only issue we have with all of this is this, this food is gonna go bad because we can't move it. Is she eating for two? Did she try it? Yay! Oh my god, okay. This is literally life-changing. This is mind-blowing. Um, I already have a best friend, but sure. Can you have more best friends? Inside, what does that even mean? I don't know what that means. So I'm gonna say no. <laughs> oh, she's got a great reputation. That's, I don't know what the inside thing. I mean, we already rejected it. Can we put this away? Cause like, otherwise it's just gonna go off and we don't want that. Okay, I'm so happy she's pregnant now, but now they're just gonna keep cooking. This was good until I realized they're just gonna cook everywhere. <laughs> Maybe I might take cooking off, but cooking is really helpful as well. So that's why I don't wanna take it off. I'm not sure. They can all leave my house. I can like end this gathering now, right? They've. Cleaned, they've cooked. 
<laughs> this is actually, I swear to God. Oh, hey Ian, what's up? Um, I swear to God, this is like life changing. Now I like probably should take, okay, he's fine. Grove is fine. Is Franklin fine? Franklin's fine. Oh, I, f um, sure. I forgot about the dynamics. I want Bjorn to leave so I can use my computer because then she can start writing books again. Because as much as I love this income we're getting, it's like getting less and less. And at some point, because I said when Grover fully moves out, we're going to like make a massive new house. Uh, we're going to make a massive new house when Grover moves out, but we're going to like wait till he moves out. I guess we're just going to wait for that. I'm really annoyed I can't put this in the fridge. I don't know why Delilah can't either. Oh, why is he aggressive? Oh, he's playing. That was so cute. Oh my God. I can't believe I missed that. That was adorable. How is it already dirty again in here? I get I don't have like the changing table, but it's just like not really worth the space that it takes up. Oh my god, so cute. Okay. Um, I heard about this glitch happening. I didn't think it was gonna happen to me. I might have to like reset her. Can I do that? Okay, I just reset her and I like, I think that, oh no, it didn't take, I was gonna say it might have taken away like the hygiene stuff, but it didn't. Okay, Grover is turning out to be an actual mess, which like, his name's Grover, so I'm not like that surprised, but it's still annoying. Why is the baby sleeping on the floor? Guys, we have two children. We got the first baby taken away before we even had another child. We weren't even pregnant. We had one child and she got taken away. Frank, and now Franklin's hungry. <laughs> My God. Okay, anyway, but then now we have two and they're struggling so much. I like need a teenager in this house. I need Grover to hurry up because it's just, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna save the game right now. I have a feeling Franklin is gonna be taken away. I just like, even though I'm trying to feed him, I don't know if it's like gonna work in time. Um, so I'm just hoping, I'm hoping she doesn't in time. But anyway, I just saved just in case she doesn't cause I don't want another child to be taken away. Cause then I think I failed the challenge. Like honestly, I think at that point I'm, I'm failed. Why is she not feeding him? Are you kidding me? Feed your child. What? I don't know why I suck at this challenge so bad. <laughs> This is horrific. This is actually horrific. Oh my god, great. It's almost Franklin's birthday, which means that he can- why? Okay, I think it's because he's asleep, but like she needs to feed him. Okay, Grover is turning out to be a problem child, which like, again, not surprised, but it's still annoying. Um, Franklin is fine, but like, it's just- I forgot about these things. I don't want him in my house. Oh, I hate the gnomes so much. I could just sell them. I know there's like, I could just like try and appease them, but I don't really want to. They leave right after half, maybe I'll just leave them in my house. They don't leave after today, I'm gonna have to sell them because I don't want them in here. But she really needs to like feed this child and also get him off the floor. I'm really glad she's pregnant though. I also wanted to write a book, but I don't want that to interfere with her taking care of the children. Because if it does, I'm gonna have some issues. I think she's mad because she can't have a shower because Franklin's in the way. But if she just moved Franklin, we wouldn't have issues because then Franklin would just be in bed. I don't know why she put him on the floor. Like that, she purely did that by herself. Okay, well, if he's awake now, she can feed him and maybe like do everything so he's fine. He's asleep again. Do kids really sleep this much? I feel like they don't, right? <sighs> it's gonna be a long day. A long, long day. How long does it take for her to give birth again? It's like a few days, right? I think Franklin might be aged up by then, which would be really iconic of him. Even in a game, I feel bad for not making it finish. I'm like, I don't know, even though it's fake money in a fake game where nobody actually needs donations. <laughs> sure. <laughs> I can't believe I just did that. Oh my God. I mean, Delilah did it. It's Delilah. It's her. She's making bad decisions. They're not gonna like hurt me, right? Honestly, I don't play enough to like know what happens on Harvest Fest. Okay, I'm gonna like take care of Franklin, right? I'm gonna get Delilah to take care of Franklin because then we will be fine for a little while, I'm thinking, I think. I can age him up. Wait, is it his birthday? Maybe I will age him up. I don't wanna like age him up. He looks so sad. Oh, now I feel bad. Okay, well, he's taking care of. How's Grover? Is he just asleep? Perfect. Grover is no longer a problem child. Oh, because it, this isn't... I thought he adopted her and I was like, what? But maybe he did because it wouldn't show who she was adopted by. I also didn't know he was married to Judith Ward. That's also a bit weird. But wait, okay. So he's got, he's got so many half siblings. I feel so bad for Bernice. Poor Bernice. She's just going through life and she has this child and then she has another child and she has another one. 
And then she also has a child she doesn't know about. Maybe I should make friends with Bernice. Should I make friends with Bernice? Oh, wait, this is from, um, what's it called? Growing Together? They're from Growing Together, aren't they? Well, that's a bit sad. But like, hmm, hmm. I love looking at the family trees. It's very interesting. Okay, so she's just taking care of Franklin, which is like, oh, wait, I didn't know he would interrupt. That's so cute. Yo, when we play like, a challenge where you don't have to have a hundred children. This is gonna be really iconic. Oh, is there just like a help with needs button? That is, it's perfect. It's really perfect. Okay, she's really uncomfortable. She really needs to use the toilet. Um, okay, that's fine. I'll just make sure she takes care of her own needs as well. Okay, so I literally tried to take care of all the Sims needs and I like think I've got them fine, but now I'm worried because Franklin's, I was trying to do it so she can like work on her like books so we can get some more money. So I'm trying to do that now. I hope she can write like a few more. Don't put him on the floor. This is ruining all my, I'm gonna have to pause the game. Why is she just yelling at him? <laughs> he's a toddler. He's not even a toddler, he's an infant. Um, really looking great there. Yeah, I'm trying to get all those skills up now. Because she's pregnant, I like don't have to worry about anything else. I think, sorry, you don't get that anymore. I need you to write books. Because if she writes some more books, then we'll have a lot more income coming in. And like, we need, we need income. We need a lot more income coming in because we're about to have a hundred children and we need to like build a massive house for all these children. That is the moral of the story and that's what I'm trying to do until she has the next child because I feel like with three children, like this is just only going to get worse. So I need to get everything done while I can and then make it all good. You know what I mean? Yeah, great. I'm so glad we're on the same page. <laughs> yeah, I'm also trying to get Grover. I'm trying to get Grover's like skills up. I don't know. I feel like it gives some benefit when they're children. I can't really remember. Again, I, I haven't played, like actually played gameplay in The Sims for a long time. I've mainly been building. So I'm just trying to get all his skills up. And then hopefully, I mean, I need to get, what I need to get is his, um, there's been some water damage. What I need to get really is his, um, whatever this is called, potty like training up. I don't know if I can do that. Franklin's fine, right? He's fine. Oh my God, I forgot tomorrow's Franklin's birthday. Well, that's perfect. That's actually perfect. Okay, that's great. And then I don't know, again, I can't remember how long it takes for them to have children. And there is nothing indicating to me now that she's gonna have a child anytime soon. So she's in her second trimester. I think I can see with MCC, but I don't know if I have MCC on right now. I had to delete it when the game updated. Why is Franklin very hungry? I just fed him like a few hours ago. Can you feed him please? Wait, he can age up soon, right? Wait, can he age up now? Oh my God, okay, wait, do I have to age him up or is he gonna age up himself? I don't know, who's calling her, Bjorn? Um, sure, sure. <laughs> okay, she fed him, that's fine. I need him to age up though. Can I age him up? Yeah, right? If it's his birthday, I age him up. Let's just age him up, <laughs> I don't even know what I'm saying. I, I, I'm gonna keep getting this unhappy infant, <laughs> like always, okay, it's fine. It's fine because it's only our second baby, so it's fine, I'm staying calm. I think this episode will be ended Oh my god. Why does he look taller than Grover? Maybe it's just the hair. Oh, that's so Oh no, now Grover's sad. I'm so sorry, Grover. Grover's whole life is just gonna be in sadness. Um, at least now they can play together. Oh, what was I saying? Yeah, this episode will end when she has the, the third child. I think that's like perfect. Okay, I'm hoping it's a girl because we've had two boys. Like, I feel like we need a girl in the mix. Yeah, okay, he's unhappy, but Franklin is happy, right? At least now she's only taking care of two toddlers, which, like, isn't much better, but infants are so- Why are infants, like, so hard? I don't even know. Okay, oh, she's at least- Okay, ooh, loves wake-up time. That's- that's great. I'm so glad. Should I, like- Are either of them awake? Should I, like- I should probably potty train them, right? Now that her- Oh, her needs are starting to not be met. Whoopsie. Um, it was good for, like, five seconds. I, like, would say this but I don't want to. Should I say yes or should I say no? No, she cares about them. She just doesn't have a lot of time on her hands. I think it's fine. I think it's fine. Okay, yeah, I'm hoping she can teach them to like go to the potty because I know it takes a second, but for one second their needs were met and it was great. And I feel like if we do the potty, it'll make it a lot easier. Oh, okay. Wait, that's so cool. I'm so glad she's single and loving it because she's gonna have to do it for a lot longer. Um. Oh, I hate all these stupid like festivals and things. I mean, they're fun when you're actually playing the game, but oh, I'm gonna get a new one of these. Wait, I got one with Franklin, didn't I? Did I ever put Franklin's one up? I don't think I did. Wait, let's go to her inventory. 
I'm like gonna have to stop putting these up at some point. Oh, why isn't it staying? Okay, maybe this is the point because I'm gonna have a hundred, which is, it's not gonna fare well. It's not gonna go well at all. Um, Bjorn just said he got a gift for us and I'm kinda, oh, what's wrong with Franklin? Oh, he just really needs to sleep, that's fine. I, I'm confused, but intrigued nonetheless. <laughs> yeah, that's fine, but what was our gift? Oh, okay, a bit weird. Bjorn, you can chill. I don't think I, whose children? <laughs> I think one is Nox's child, right? Yeah. Yo, this is actually getting hard to remember whose child I have and whose I don't. Oh, and she's gonna pee herself. Great. Great. Is that Marcus? Yeah. Marcus, sorry, but like, I don't really need you around anymore. Um, sorry about that. Yo, this is really random and nothing to do with the game, but I'm pretty sure a spider bit my shoulder the other night and it's been really itchy ever since. It's really uniconic of my shoulder, actually. Um, I'm pretty sure it was a spider though, because I thought I felt one on my hand the other night, but then I was like, I don't know if that's a spider or not. Um, just Australia things. <laughs> but it's like an actual bad bite. Well, not, it's not bad, but it's just like, usually when you get like animal bites, like spite, like insect bites here, it's like you'll get a little bump and then it'll go away. But this one's like proper, like <laughs> it's a bit TMI. But I guess if you know, if you live in Australia, you'd know. You just sometimes, sometimes you just get spider bites. I don't know if this is common in other places, but here, um, these windows are like not that great. They're also not even. Okay, Grover needs to hurry up and leave so I can build a better house. <laughs> can they play together? I've never had two toddlers at the same time. I don't. Yeah, they can't. Oh, he can like. Oh, okay. Grover, go get food. That's the thing. I, they they always like are very hungry, but I have food out for them that they can get. So I don't know what's going on there. See, he didn't even eat it. He just. Grover, you like actually have to eat something so you don't get taken away. Same with you, Franklin. Please just eat something. <laughs> All the days, I know you can get rid of them, but they're really frustrating and I haven't been bothered to get rid of them. I don't know if I am good. She's just feeding herself. She, two children that are just causing havoc. I like really want to invite around the 100 baby squad to clean up, but I'm also like, there's no point having them around until I have one of their children. Oh, she's bathing Grover. That's cute. Um, so I'm kind of like, mm, I don't know. Like, I'll just, I'll wait till we have this baby. And then next episode, I'll invite him around, get another baby and get my house clean. It's great. And I don't even have to pay the $200 that they keep charging me for the cleaning services, even though they don't show up. Oh, she's just like putting them to bed. I like love this outfit, but I'm also like, I don't know why the backpack comes on because it just means she's wearing a backpack the whole time. I'm going to have to after this episode. Okay. If I just let them be, she like takes care of them better than I can. How does he hate bedtime but loves wake up time? Oh, I guess that makes sense. Oh, and now she's just, okay. She's gonna leave him in that. That's the bit that's not helpful, Delilah. <laughs> um, but yeah, she takes care of them better than I can. What was I saying? Uh, Franklin, Franklin, I'm gonna have to like change his outfits between the episodes. I might film an episode straight after this though. Change his outfit at some point. <laughs> oh, now the fridge is gross. But yeah, I changed their outfits like I don't do it when they're infants because there's not really a point. I don't see a point in that. But when they're toddlers, I do. But I do it between episodes. <laughs> so we'll have to like wait till after the next episode or the one after that. I don't know how much I'm going to film today, but I'm kind of in the mood for a 100 baby challenge. So I'm definitely going to film a few. Um, so it's going to be great. The aim is to have a pregnancy per episode. And like so far, that hasn't worked. because <laughs> So far, that hasn't worked. But I'm hoping it's gonna start working with my 100 baby squad house. So I think, okay, Grover, he's like happy now, right? Okay, we're gonna try and get his skills up. Oh, yeah, I would, but like, I don't have the time right now. Yeah, we're gonna try and get his skills up. What are his skills like right now? Movement for communication, thinking, imagination, potty. I wish they could potty train themselves. It's just like really annoying that they can't because Delilah does not have the time right now. But I'll set him up for skills. And I'll see what Franklin's doing. Because, like, I want to get their skills up. I can't... I feel like there is some benefit when they turn into children. But now I can't remember. Okay, Franklin's only thing is that... If I get him to grab some food and then eat it and then work on skills. He should be fine, right? Yeah. I have no long till she has... I, I have no idea how long it takes till she has this baby. Is she in her third trimester? Yeah. It should be soon. I'm thinking. I ho I'm hoping. I swear. It seems so pregnant for, like... I don't know how many days. Like, five? Four? Well, Franklin aged up. I'll we'll have to check next time. Oh, who's this guy? Say hi. Ahoy, me matey. Ahoy. Army hearty. <laughs> oh, that's a bit unfortunate. <laughs> There's just one wall that's not done. Yeah, make friends with this guy. I'm so glad that we're making friends with this random guy. And you know why? 
because he might be a nice baby daddy. <laughs> oh, he's gone. Okay. Oh, she's going into labor. Okay. Okay. This is great. I'm really hoping for a girl. It's against it because there's ways that you can make it a girl or a boy in The Sims, but you're not, you're not supposed to do that 100 baby challenge. And I don't know what it is. It's something to do with strawberries, or like watermelon or like I think if you listen to a certain kind of music, but like I can't do it anyway, so it doesn't matter. But maybe my, oh my God, that's so cute. I need to have children more often in The Sims. Um, now I learned last time that you actually have to make them give, give birth. So that's what we're gonna do. But I'm hoping for a girl. If we have a girl, I can't really call her Hazel, can I? No, it's like, what do I call her? I think we're just random nice names. Yes, thank God. Okay, no, no, no. Okay, wait, I'll just like do it, do it, do it. Angel, that's such a sweet name. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Oh, I was kind of hoping for twins then. I was like, I really hope she has. Oh, okay, this is so cute. Well, I think with the birth of Angel, that is the end of our episode right there. Look how cute she is. I don't know why Hazel was such an ugly baby. None of the babies after Hazel have been ugly. Maybe Hazel got taken away because they called her ugly. She felt offended. That, that would be very fair. But anyway, this baby is not as ugly as Hazel. She's not ugly. Oh, she's so cute. Okay, now they have a sister. Oh, I'm so excited. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, let me know. Let me. And if you have any baby name suggestions, actually let me know because I like, I'm not gonna like think of names. I'm just gonna do the randomizer. So if you want a baby called a name, I will I will let you have a baby called a name. I will, I will call the babies whatever name you want them to be called. But anyway, hope you have a lovely day, night, evening, afternoon, whatever it is, wherever you are. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.